So a few things about anger, ill will, and all this, and 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 so on. Um, so this this is part of right intention, yeah, to live our life without all this. Uh, but why should we live our life without all this? To begin with, while we occasionally feel hatred, and sometimes ill will, yeah, and some of this may feel very justified, uh, especially in the case, in certain cases, where maybe there are some injustice that is done. So we may feel ill will or anger and so on, um, almost as a form of justification. You know, we may feel justified to be angry. We may feel justified for to wish for that person to come to harm. Yeah, we may even feel justified. Yeah. Uh, so um, consider this. Um, I've shared before how sometimes students come to me for consult, and they will share with me in full detail the, you know whatever they have experienced. Yeah. And they would often times make this statement that so and so was wrong, so and so did wrong, and they are right. Yeah. And that's why they are angry. Um, on one hand, it is that it means that their anger is justified because of the wrong that was done. Yeah, but if you join the whole sentence, then it becomes quite interesting. They are wrong, I'm right, I'm angry. They are wrong, I'm right, I'm angry. I'm right, I'm angry. If we are right, why are we angry? Why should the one who is correct be angry? Given that being angry doesn't make you feel good. Yeah. If, I, if I were to ask the blatant question, it, when you are having anger, are you happy or not happy? Of course you are not happy, isn't it? Yeah. So, does it make sense that we should be the one to be angry? Or rather, we should be the one to be robbed of happiness when really something bad happened? Yeah. When there's injustice, that really something bad has happened. And then further, we further that by being angry when we are in the right. 